Guys, we got a slime problem. Does anybody know how to fix this? Guys, welcome back to Stone Block 3. Guys, behind me is a mess. A mess just like inside my mind. I'm jumping all over the place, but at least we got into some applied energistics. We've done everything you see behind me in this episode. So let's get started. All right, guys. So we've got the processors. We've got them done. Now we need a Fluix crystal. So we need to charge some Certus Quartz. Therefore, we need the Tesla coil. But the Tesla coil needs to be powered. I need the rolling mill. This will allow us to create iron rods and wires. Sorry, not just iron rods. Rods and wires. So, need one on the side casing. Four of those. Shafts we have. And two iron sheets. Here. This, I think it's time to try another source of power or rotational force. Let's build the windmill. Nice. So guys, for the windmill, we need sail blocks or sails. Guys, at this point, I didn't know it needed 124 sails to be in maximum power and I had no idea how it works. So I was just messing around. You can watch that or skip to the point where I have this build. Then of course I tried different ways of building it. I tried, uh, I, I actually at the beginning I wanted it to look like a normal windmill would look. But yeah, that didn't work. Especially without creative flight, it was so hard to build um, I just got mm, sick of it. But I did finish it as I wanted it. Well, almost. It wasn't perfect. But yeah, I didn't like it. So I just moved it under the ground. And this worked out much better. Once I had the power going, I set up the rolling mill. Uh, very easy to set up. Basically, you need a running belt, mechanical belt, with uh, two funnels going into the mill. Uh, one for input, one for output. Once the setup was done, I made a few iron rods and a few other materials. Oh my god. Uh, I guess I should be chasing bees, guys. As you can see, I got two dark matter. That's from one bee. Right, guys? I AFK'd a bit and I got a lot of roads and some wire. I think those are all useless. <laughs> I'm not even sure why I made them. So, next step would be to make some mechanical crafters for the Tesla coil. See. One, two, three. How much does one use? 500. I think that's going to be too much. How do we make a speed controller? Mm -hmm. Nice. We can make that. 256. Is that even possible? Oh, 
Wait, what? Hmm. Oh my god. After I figured how the speed controller works, I set up a set of mechanical crafters for the Tesla coil, which is 3x5, three, three width, 5 height, and I made them working by reducing the speed. You will also need oh, to place some slot covers. Then, I made another set of mechanical crafters for the engine, for the create engine, uh, which I never used, I believe. I wanted to test it, but I discovered that it needs power to run and I thought, why would I use it? Instead, I needed an uh, alternator, which I had from Loot Drops. Perfect. Like a song. And let's see, guys. Let's see. I think everything will work. Stay with the motor. Go. Sure. Perfect. We got an engine. Now, oh. Tesla coil. Very nice. It was at this point, guys, that I realized that I didn't need an electric motor from the start. All I needed was the alternator, which I had from very early in the game, and I believe I got it from a quest reward. So. I had no idea how the electric motor works, but basically you need to provide it with power for it to provide rotational force. Which, uh, yeah, it's not what I needed. All I needed was power to power the Tesla coil. And we get that from the alternator. Oh well, that's not what I want. This is what I want. But how do I charge it? That? Yes, it is like that. So how do I place the Certus coil? I also had no idea how to use the Tesla coil, so I tried setting it up on the ground with a lever. It didn't work out well. Ah. No. So I changed the setup with the Tesla coil facing downwards into a depot where I placed the Certus quartz. And this worked out. Oh, nice guys. So this is how it's done. Alright guys, so I got a stack. Now we need a st stack of quartz and a stack of redstone. This it here. Throw this. Redstone. Quartz. Charge thingies. It doesn't it not work? Does it need time? Does it need time? Quick dust. Oh! It did work! Nice. Very nice. I think you just uh, make seeds out of it. So let's make some seeds Boom. and throw them into water. Nice. And now we have to wait. While we were waiting for the Fluix crystals to be done, we made some sky stone blocks, which is made by smelting sky stone dust into sky stone and then sky stone into sky stone block. All right, guys, we got the crystals we got the blocks we'll need some processors right engineering pro how many should we make let's make all of them then boom nice what do we get diamond hammer absolutely useless 
Next thing is an ME drive and an ME security terminal. Do we need that? Ah, yes. Wireless terminal. Right. ME drive. What do we need? We need some uh, Fluix ME glass. Uh, we're going to have a problem with the Certus cords. We need some glass automation as well. All right, guys. We got the ME drives. All right, guys. So next thing I want is an ME terminal and a crafting terminal. I think this will make our life much easier. So what do we need? Quartz glass. Should be easy. How much glass do we have? Mm. Mm. I already knew, guys, that we didn't have much glass. I had seen this coming, but I forgot to make an automated uh, glass production, call it whatever you want. So I did, guys. Very easy. Cobblestone gen going into three diamond auto hammers or whatever level uh, auto hammers you want. Making sand, dropping into a heated fan, basically, basically smelting the sand into glass. Easy. All right, we got some quartz, we got some glass. Let's make some glass. Ah, uh, not that much. <laughs> Anyways, we'll get more later if we need it. Let's see, two glowstone, one redstone, two glowstone, and an iron ingot. Very nice. Should be. Come on, be perfect now. Okay, okay. Fluix dust. Wait, does it need the dust? How do we get dust from this? Why would you do that to me? Back to our humble beginnings. <laughs> oh, guys, I'm so sick of the slimes. Can we do anything about them? Can we do anything about them? Oh, formation core, annihilation core. Nice. Does it even fit? Nope. It needs the, the storage. Well, that's okay. Let's make a 1k storage. All right. Right, all right, all right. Where? Okay, noise, 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 noise. Boom. Um, 1k. <laughs> 1k. Let's go. Guys, uh, yeah, as you can see, I get, I'm get i running around like a noob. Let's put it in. And now I think, yes, 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 yes. This is amazing. This is amazing. Why? Because we won't have to run around soon enough. Alright. What do we need for the crafting terminal? Need another one of those. I think we can make it. Boom. Now. Bada bim bada boom. Very nice guys. Very nice. Look at here. Yes, this is much better. Much better. At this point, the crafting was getting tedious, guys. So I had to assist myself with automating at least part of it. We needed a pattern encoding terminal, which basically allows you to use a blank pattern and assign a crafting recipe to it. Then I also made a dense energy cell which would allow us to store any excess energy produced by the alternator. Noish. We crafted a stack of blank patterns. An ME pattern provider. 
which basically provides the patterns into the molecular assembler. Then we needed some crafting units and crafting processors or CPUs which are needed for the crafting. Without them you cannot craft anything, you cannot use the molecular assembler. It's basically like a computer processor. And I believe the more bytes you give it, I gave it 1k, but you need more, the more it can craft or the faster it can craft, then you need a molecular assembler which basically does the crafting. And it needs to be connected to the pattern provider. Then I made patterns for the storage components, all the way from 1k to 256k. Alright, let's see. What do we need for 16k? Ooh, start. Nice. Wait, it's done? What is this? It's not done, is it? Oh, it is done. Why did it not go back? I see, because I'm a noob. <laughs> but we got a 16k one. I want now I want the housing pattern. Perfect. Perfect. And let's make a few housings. Can we craft 10? Iron. Let's see. I see. Uh, oh, tank. Here's some iron. Crafter. Then. Perfect. It is crafting them. Wait. Nice. Why did this come back? I don't get it. I don't get it. Let's pick up one of those. And actually, let's also make those 4K, sorry, K, um, storage cell. Now uh, we don't have enough space. Anyways, let's combine the two to have more space. Nice. Now at this point I thought 16k will be enough to host all our items. I was completely wrong. Hmm. See. Well let's see if we can craft a 256k one. Alright. Missing 280. Oh Jesus. Oh Jesus. What do we need for a... Uh... 64k 64 certo squares we got this guys we got this or we don't maybe we don't okay. guess we have to wait nice guys these uh, crystals worked out better than i thought Let's see, if I place this in here, can we craft the 64 one? We can. Let's see, Amy pattern access. This will allow us to access all the patterns. See? So, this shows us the patterns stored in here. Ooh, I think the storage one is done. Nice. 64k perfect perfect and a casing that before nice we got even more storage now guys all right guys i think i have enough mats to make the 256 one storage nobly aha uh -huh. i don't have enough space Oh, let's take out uh, brass file. No, no crafting CPUs are available. Oh. 
Craft and see. What do you mean? Ah, uh, I guess it needs more. Hold on. Let's get back to this. Crafting unit 64. We need to attach it right here. Can we do it 256 now? Yes, we can. Perfect. So it needed more like crafting power or processors, which is amazing. Oh my god, guys, food for days. And we got a plate of roast chicken and more rabbit stew. That is all right, guys. Next step is wireless crafting. So I want to make oh, it's ready. I wanted to make another ME pattern provider. I hope this works. Let's see. Do we have a pattern for formation? And no, we don't. Let's fix that real quick. Oops. Uh, I mean, we don't have one, right? Oh, we do, we do. So I think. Yeah, I don't remember how. How to. Yeah, just like that, I believe. Oh. ME chest. Perfect. Do we have an ME terminal? Pattern. I don't think we do. ME security pattern. Let's see. Nice. Perfect. Can we make a security terminal? Redstone and copper. All right, it should be fine now. Craft. I think there was a way to see how what's the crafting process. Add applied uh, crafting monitor. Nice. Can I? Place it here. No, I can't. How about here? No, I can't. What if I take one of those? Did we make the security terminal? Yes, we did. No, no, no. We need a wireless terminal. So, oh. wireless receiver. Go oh, expert. I don't want to craft it. I want to make a recipe for it. Perfect. And I want one of those. Also perfect. And a dense energy cell. And I also want a cell pattern. Oops. Nice. But I don't think we have enough space. Actually, we do. Nice. So let's see if we can craft at least the receiver. We okay. can. Perfect. So what do we need? We need a dense energy cell. Can we craft it? No, we can't. Hold on. Let's, let's actually double check. Oh, we can. Perfect. So once this is ready, is ready. Nice. Wireless terminal. Hold on a sec. How do we link it? It is linked. Device is low on power. We need a charger. I. Charge. Where is it to make? 
Hey, boo. Hey, boo. You boo. It's a... Uh, this... This should be perfect, right? Okay, it is. But I don't want this. I want a wireless crafting terminal. Should have enough. Perfect. Now we charge. Let's see what we get, guys. Ooh. Chapter completed. Getting started. Nice. I think... I think we've done everything, guys. We just need... Wireless thingy to be charged. And we need some better power. Let's actually pick it up and test how... How far away? Oops, we need to link it. Just place it here and it's linked. Nice. What? Wireless is out of range. What else do we need? Hot applied wire. I guess we need uh, this. Alright. Perfect. This should be okay now. Oh my god, this is awesome. How far away can it go out of range? Are you serious? That's like 10 blocks. Hmm. How do we upgrade that? Wireless block range. 16 blocks. I see. I see. But we need this one. Let's make a booster. 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 Two wireless boosters. Does it like work in stacks? Wait, what? Two and a two, three meters? Oh, come on, guy. Come on. You can do better than that. We make more. I'm out of fluid dust. Hmm. 24. How far away is that? It's like about here, right? Hmm. Yeah, that's not going to work. All right, guys. Let's see. I needed some flux dust, and uh, I guess my goal is to build an infinity booster. Wireless. Yeah, this one. Pretty easy to make. Pretty easy. But I needed some fluids dust, which I should have enough of now. Let's see, let's see. And yeah, have two of those. Boom, like a so. After auto crafting complete. Nice. Then I need a receiver. I just need one. Perfect. And It's done. It's done. And then, yeah, boost. This one. Let's see, where do I put this? Do I place this here? No. Wireless crafting terminal. Wireless. Right. Where do I place it? Oh. Wait. Hold on. Does this mean I can access it now? Wait, what? Wait, what? That's it? Oh my... Oh my god, that's it, by the way, guys. Remember the holy shit up of washing? It's gone. Yeah, I used it all. Wait. That's so easy, guys. No energy required? Like extra? Why would you make the boosters then? I don't get it. Why Why not make this? Right, guys. So I think the next thing I want to do is automate uh, more Certus Quartz. So let's see how we can do that. We need Certus Quartz Dust, which can be 
cotton from washing, a very low chance. Then we also have this, um, well, we can get the ores, the Certus Quartz ores. Hmm. I don't want to get into Botania yet. Then there's the laser drills from Industrial Foregoing. And I believe there was one more option. Budding crystals. But that's it, guys. I haven't found any other options. So, if you saw... I've set up some budding crystals, but I don't, I don't really like them. And they're not growing that fast. So, I'm not sure if I want to go into them. But I don't know, guys. They're kind of good. But I have no idea how to automate them. Like, I don't have any any pedestals, like dark dark matter pedestals to speed them up, etc. So, I don't think that's an option for us. Therefore, I got this from a reward. And I think I want to set up some auto hammers. More auto hammers, like... A lot of them to make dust and wash it i think that's gonna be a good idea so let's see if we can do that all right guys let's see to make the iron auto hammer i need a recipe for for stone roads yes iron hammer iron auto hammer and i need a recipe for the golden hammer the golden auto hammer. and i need a recipe for the diamond hammer and a recipe for the diamond auto hammer and i think this should be okay as long as we provide this with the materials all right guys i want to connect this storage controller to my ma system of course i'm a noob so everything is far away and i don't believe i can uh, wirelessly set it up yet i think i need an ME storage bus perfect now i will need a lot of cable I think we'll need more. I think we'll need more. Now let's see if it's enough. Noise. Nice. Guys, we got access. Amazing. So what did I want to make? I forgot. Hammer. So we need four or one dust. Can we make nine? Nine times four, thirty-six. Can we make thirty-six? Missing thirty-five. Diamond hammer. Didn't I give you... Alright. I didn't. I did not. No, I did. Wait, that's weird. Can we craft like... 36? Yeah, just do it. Perfect. This should be nice. Nice, nice, nice. Missing 35. What have I done? What have I done? Let's see. I have done some goof. Yes, I have. Let's place it back. Yes, I want, I want this. No, that's correct. That's correct. So this is not correct. Let's see. Maybe I didn't change it. Maybe I didn't. Let's see. Perfect. Start. Let's see. Two minutes. Wait, to finish the whole thing? 
Oh no, it needs more time. <laughs> That's amazing, guys. That's amazing. Okay, guys. So what I want to do is place this here. Then I want this problem back. I want this. Does it transfer? Oops, oops, oops. I'm being an Uber again, I'm being an Uber again. Come on. Yes, it does. Well, that's not fast enough. Type upgrade, where is my... Nice, the hammers are done. Right, here are the pipe upgrades. And I got some used ones, so... We use... Ooh, I also have four extra, nice. So... I want one. Actually, I don't want. Where do I? Yeah, I I want. I want a lot. Actually, let's get rid of the of the thingy. Can I pump from all sides? Let's check it. Let's check it. Yes. Yes. And yes, perfect, perfect. So I want advanced pipe upgrades. Eight. And I want them to go like a so. And we'll place an extra row right here. Yep, this should be fine. Now let's see, can this thing keep up with all of them? Alright guys, I think it can keep up. The actual hammers cannot keep up, but the, the cobble gen does keep up. Maybe we need even more of those. How about... Hmm. How about another... 284 boom start oh my god guys oh my god how much is that gonna take 30 minutes okay i'll be back soon all right guys this should be ready now oh my god oh my god
So guys, we got the, I don't even know how to call it guys, check this out. We should get a lot of Certus Squirts. Alright guys, I'm going to AFK for half a day and let's see what the resort results are like. Alright guys, so I've been away for about two hours, check this out. 10k of Certus Quartz. That's amazing. Se almost 17k of Redstone. Anyways, guys, but this thing cannot keep up one, one of those. So I think I'm going to place, just for the fun, another hmm, three. Alright guys, let's see if we can make Crystal Grove Chamber. I need a hopper. I need a chest. I need one of those. One of those. One of those. And one of those. We'll fix the storage later guys. We'll connect everything. Don't you worry. Here and a hopper. And then here we got this for. Let's see if we can craft. We need two. We need two. Perfect. How much time does it need? Ooh, it's almost done. That is amazing, guys. That is amazing. Let's see. What is going on? How about this? Why? How many channels does it need? It's working. I'm not sure what's up. I think it's the channels, guys. That's my only explanation. This thing is now working, which is amazing. But we're out of Fluix crystals. Charts there to score. Only one thing can do it. All right, let's see if we can make some energy pipe and let's see if we can power it up from this thing right here. By power it up, I mean the Tesla coil. No, we can't. Hmm. How about this thing? No, we can't. Well, that's not very amazing, is it? Hmm. How about if we move it back into some pipes, like a so? Will this accept energy? It's not. Unless we need to do this. Yes. Nice. So this was my mistake. And I assume we can place a Tesla coil. Not like this. Like this. Perfect. Perfect. And now we need a depot. A depot. A depot. Just one. And oops. Maybe we should move that up. No blocks, no blocks. I have no blocks. Boom. Ah, dust is okay. Dust is perfectly fine. So, let's move that right here. Place our Tesla coil our depot and we need some ports nice this will charge the cords very nice now
13k that's amazing guys that's amazing i need to start moving to a new room you know a storage room because yeah i'm not organized guys i'm not organized at all i used to be an event organizer like yeah but outside of my job i'm not organized i just i just chill all right do we have charged ores just 11 hmm is there another way to create this can I place it inside a charger, maybe? What do we need for the Fluix dust? Alright, alright, alright. We need some water, we need some water. Do I have any buckets? Yes, I do. Mm -hmm. Oh no. Oh no, oh no, oh no. Oi! Hello, trader. Hello, trader. How about here? Perfect. Alright, some water. Throw in the charge quartz, the redstone, and the nether quartz. And you get Fluix dust. Then we'll need some sand. And we get two stacks of seeds. Oops, what have I done? There you go. Almost two stacks of seeds. Place them inside and this should be going much faster than 20 minutes inside the water. How many do we have? Let's see. <coughs> All right, guys, so I got this figured out. So if you actually place it after, it breaks. But if you place it first, hold on a sec. I want a nice setup. Let's do it like so. But if you place it first and then at the cable, it doesn't break, which is fantastic. Fantastic news. Alright guys, so next step. Crystal production and Fluix crystal production. So let's see what, how can we do it. Alright guys, this is a noob setup, but uh, yeah. I am a noob, so accept my apologies. I got pipes going from the... Set this quartz dust drawer into a mechanical crafter, and then I have a Fluix cable from our system going into the second one with an Emmy exporter bus providing sand. Let's see if this works, guys. Nice, it does. Can this thing export into this? It can. That is amazing news. Can I connect it? I can. Oh my god. So we got the Certus Quartz Crystals Automated. Nice. I mean, I believe that thing will keep up. Like, making so much. So many. Now, can we keep up with power? How is, is our power doing? It's going up. It's actually going up. That's okay for now. Now. Alright guys, I'm a total noob. I have no idea how to get energy from the ME system. So I'm just gonna do that. Which will look like poop. But... That's what you get when you're a noob. Let's see. I want a Tesla coil here. Why did I make an energy cell? I don't even remember. This is getting some power. And then I need an energy depot. Actually, 
I want to try one last thing. Can I charge the quartz in the charger? I'm assuming not. Wait, what? I can? I can? I don't need the Tesla coil then. Is it here? Yeah, that works better. Then I need an import bus and an export bus. You need an export bus to export stuff from the system. Nice, nice. Now we need an import bus, which is for the import into the system, but export from the charger. Wait. This should work. Nice, nice. We got two processes automated, guys. Now, the next thing I want is Fluix Crystal. So how do we get that? We need these three items. No, I guess we have to throw it in water. All right, guys, let's see if that works. I want to place down a chute. And then I want one export bus here. Then one here and one here. Export buses. Yeah, like a soul. One, two, and three. And I want I want this on charged cords. Perfect. It works. Oh my god, guys. Oh my god. I want redstone. Right? This is what I want. I want this on redstone. And what else do I need? What else do I need? Never quartz. Never quartz. I want this on never quartz. Why is it just dropping one? Device missing channel. Oh my god. Alright guys, I moved the whole setup to the Den Smart cable. Now guys, I believe if I place some water here, it should work. Or maybe an item collector? Oh yeah, that's easy to make. Noise. And then maybe... Let's see. Let's see, Fluix. Fluix dust, 135. Why is it not collecting it? Hello? Maybe it needs a chest. Let's check. I think it's working, guys. Maybe it needed a chest. Let's see. Yeah, nice. Nice, nice, nice. How are we doing on power? We are going down drastically. Right, right, right. Anyways. As long as we have power, let's try the next thing. What I want to do... One of those. Two of those. Some cables going... Like a so. And I'll need two export buses. Export. Alright. Very nice. One here and one here. And I want this to be Loix Dust. Perfect. And I want this to be sand. Amazing. Amazing. And now I just need some power. One. Two. <laughs> this is so noobish. But it works. Perfect. Now we got... Blue X Crystal automated. Oh my god, guys. Oh my god. Alright, guys. We are out of power, so our, our ME system is not working properly. Let's see if we can fix this with another alternator. Alternator. Only testing. Boom. Oh my god, it's going so fast. Nice. Nice, and I want an energy acceptor. Alright guys, so what I did not record is that I built another thing of those. Give me those. Perfect. 
uh, I built another windmill, which is giving like 8,000 uh, stress units. And I also crafted an alternator using this. And I placed an energy, energy acceptor because our ME system was uh, not doing well. I've built too many things and uh, yeah, I didn't have enough power. But now we do and it's going okay. It's going okay. But <laughs> guys, it's a mess. It's a mess. I know, but it's, it's amazing guys. It's amazing. All right, guys, so I AFK the night and we got like 20,000 of each Fluix crystal and Certus Quartz crystal. But guys, this has been a long episode for you and for me. If you stayed an hour, guys, you're amazing. And I really hope you enjoyed the episode and I'll see you back soon.